I already did an intro like this. No, no, that one was different. I was wearing pants and not thong. Sachet, sachet, plie, revelé, revelé, pirouette. Ah! Been trying to figure out how to enter the frame now that I'm standing in my video, so I guess ballet isn't the answer. And I starved myself for like 20 minutes. Mmm. 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 There was no time to cook this potato. It was an emergency. Mm. So today is Explosion Wednesday. It's a thing that I'm trying out. We'll see if it becomes permanent. I'm not 100% sure we'll make it a thing or not. So in explosion news, Lyrid meteor shower to light up the dark April skies. Yes! Big meteor shower to happen overnight, April 21st and 22nd. But hang on a second. Wait, 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 wait. I have questions. Why is it called Lyrid meteor shower? Well, me from further away from the camera, it appears to happen in the constellation Lyra. Why is it called Lyra? In Greek mythology, Lyra is associated with the myth of Orpheus. Who the crap is Orpheus? He was a musician killed by Bacchantes, and then his lyre was thrown into the river. And then Zeus sent an eagle to take that lyre and put it into the sky. And then Zeus punched the eagle. That last part is speculation, but really good speculation based on my emotions about eagles. I like to punch them. What are meteor showers anyway? Well, this one consists of debris from a comet with an awesome name, C1861G Thatcher. We'll call it Thatch Master from now on, or actually we probably won't even refer to it again. So basically a meteor shower is a bunch of debris falling. <laughs> I can do that. Hey look, it's a freaking meteor shower. It's a miracle of science. Hey. Make it rain. <laughs> All my money's gone, and I was gonna buy candy later. That last example was money. People do care about money, but they don't care about falling rocks and crap. Why do they care about meteor showers so much? When I see a meteor shower, I'm like, oh, hey, look, a shooting star. Hmm. Don't frickin' call up Walter Cronkite to put it on the evening news, or whoever. I, I get my news from the internet. How is Walter doing lately, anyway? And how's that Cold War thing? They warm it up yet? So is the reason people give a crap because it's big and mysterious and fiery and shooting in all directions? No, not Conan's hair, meteors. That could be the reason, but it would need something else for the media to swoon over it too. I got an answer for you. Scheduling. What? Scheduling. Meteors happen periodically at a time we can predict. Who are you? Oh, I'm no one. A cog in the machine. Remember those goals you made? Oh, <clears throat> yes. Well, since you put up those goals on the whiteboard, thanks to our free capitalist society, a whole organization formed around them to keep you in check. The Wheezy Bureau of Clerical and Departmental Affairs. We're the hidden corporate side of Wheezy Waiter Industries. Hang on a second. Bye. Sell. Sell! Sell, you junior executive maggot! Anyway, we've noticed a failure to meet your goals recently. Failure? Whatever do you mean? Yes, particular the bye, bye, the four videos a week. Yeah, well, I've been doing a lot of traveling. I just got back from an exhausting tour with my band. It's just really hard to keep it all straight in my head. Sir, with all due respect, you need structure, planning, scheduling, so that your goals are met when you're away, so that people still give a crap about you. Be the comet. What? Be the comet. The Lyrid meteor shower comes around once a year. It's stubborn, steadfast, stalwart, stringent, sturdy, st dependable. We know when it's coming, so we make plans to watch it. We rally around it. Some people bring their little people. I believe they're called children. B, the comet. You want me to make a better schedule? Yes, and a more. Buy! No, sell! Buy, then sell! A more realistic one. Okay, how about every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, I upload a video in the afternoon? Hmm, I like it. You've got moxie. And spunk. As well as pluck. And intestinal fortitude. I eat a lot of roughage. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. It just might work. He did it, boys! Hooray! Back to work. Talk to me. Are you going commie on me now, Zalewski? I said dump the chemicals in the Chicago River. I don't care if there are five orphanages downstream. Danny's got to take out the trash. I'm sure it's all regulated. We. All right, so expect Wheezy Waiter videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, I hope. Did you know that you can get the Wheezy shoes right now for $30? That's right, they're on sale. Link in the doobly-doo. And now that I've satisfied Corporate Clone, you can also donate to water.org. We're raising money. Follow the link in the doobly-doo for that. We're already halfway to our goal of $5,000, and we have like 18 days left. Let's try to get to 5000 right now. If that happens, I'll raise the goal. As you may know, I just got back from tour with my band Driftless Pony Club. I neglected to make videos on the road because I neglected to make videos on the road. But I did get video of all the audiences. Here they are. <laughs> I forgot to get the Cleveland audience. I'm so sorry about that, Cleveland audience, but you looked something like this. Yeah, that's about right. We're real popular in Cleveland.